Hello and welcome to my video on how to make a snare drum patch using ES2 on Logic Pro 9. So to begin with I have a vanilla patch here which I've created previously. Uh, and to create this patch we're going to be starting off by turning off oscillator 1 and turn on oscillator 3 and then dragging this down here so we can hear and see what's going on with oscillator 3. So uh, next we're going to be changing the wave to noise and this is what noise sounds like. See nothing much really. It's just white noise. Uh, so next one we change in the blend to about halfway if we can. There we go. And the cutoff here on the left, we're going to be changing to about halfway too. Uh, the cutoff on the right, we're going to leave fully open. And the resonance, we're just going to leave empty. And same with the drive and FM. Uh, next, we're going to move on to the modulation. So here we're going to change. Target to cut off two. We'll leave the virus off and we'll change the source to envelope three. So, moving on to the envelope, we're going to be changing this here, the decay on envelope one to the shortest. Uh, next, we're going to be changing the decay on envelope two as well. We're going to put this quite, sh uh, quite fast, I should say, but not as fast as envelope one. And then the same principle here with envelope 3, we're going to change the decay to something quite fast, but not too fast, so about 120 should do. And with both envelopes we're going to leave the sustain and release at its fastest. Now in envelope 3, I'm going to drag the time down a little bit. It's, uh, this is because when you have time up here, it the sound gradually grows louder. But if you take the time down a little bit, it doesn't happen. It's just a little snare sound. So, that's about it, really. Uh, there's not much else to it. But what we can do is turn up the drive here a bit to about the halfway point. And uh, what this does is it gives the snare a bit of an extra you know, sound to it. Well, it gives it a bit of an extra oof, I guess you could call it. And it also increases the volume a little bit. Uh, you can also turn up the drive full, but I don't know, I just don't get the same feel with this. So I like to keep it about halfway, but that's just personal preference. So that is how you create a snare drum patch using ES2 on Logic Pro 9. Thank you for watching.